us on the center of your solar system. I do erupt intense high energy radiation. This radiation I expel is called the solar flare. You learn about them in the song and why you should care. The sun is a ball of plasma like an extremely hot ocean shaped like a wheel. This plasma is pushed around and shaped by the sun's magnetic field. When the sun's plasma swirls around by its magnetic field, it gets twisted and releases energy around sunspots. They are real. This energy released is caused by magnetic knots. When one of these knots breaks, it releases solar flares. So you are taught. Solar flares are waves of high energy radiation shot through the solar system in which we are all one. These solar flares race through space at the speed of light, creating a solar proton storm. These storms are no delight. When millions of tons of plasma are thrown from the sun's atmosphere, these storms are called coronal mass ejections, as you see right here. These CMEs reach speeds of 5.6 million miles per hour. When they hit Earth, it doesn't hurt living beings even with such power. The Earth's atmosphere protects life from the biggest solar storms by absorbing the impact so beings on the surface are safe from harm. When a CME is too big, it creates a solar superstorm that occurs once or twice a century, so you've been warned. If a solar superstorm did happen in this day and age, it would shoot billions of tons of plasma from the sun, I do say. If this type of CME traveled across space towards the Earth, it would reach you in one day. Yeah, that's fast for what that is worth. Its shock wave would compress Earth's magnetic field, making it frail. The two magnetic fields would merge, stretching Earth's field into a thin tail. This stretch tail can't contain this energy anymore. When it snaps, it releases explosive energy towards the Earth that it stored. This creates something very rare called the geomagnetic storm. Normally, no living thing on Earth would even know it had formed. The only thing it would affect is your electricity. Because you rely on this so much, it would disrupt human life, you see. Because Earth is covered in millions of electric wires and transformers, this geomagnetic storm would shut down the power. Humans would be overturned. If one of these storms hit the Earth, electricity and internet would not work. All things powered by electricity would turn off along with all networks. Computers would wouldn't work along with phones and electronic devices, no refrigerators or any other household appliances. Even though we can't stop these terrible solar storms, their nasty side effects can be prevented by how we are warned. Engineers would have a day or two to unplug major power grids until the solar storm passes Earth, preventing blackouts we forbid. Humans need to prepare for these types of storms to prevent being thrown back to the stone age before they form. A cool event humans experience from any solar storm is the aurora borealis and the two poles is where they perform. I'm the life-giving sun, you all need me to live, but I am unpredictable, so solar storms I give. I am the sun, the center of your solar system. I do erupt intense high energy radiation. This radiation I expel is called the solar flare you learn about them in the song and why you should care